All right, so I know many of you will be asking if it is really, really possible for you to send bulk emails directly from Google Sheet. In this video, I'm going to prove it to you, showing you how you yourself can start sending out bulk emails every single day that will be landing in the inbox folder of your recipient directly from Google Sheet. Now, take a look at this. I'm basically trying out so many tools out there, you know, trying to figure out what is working so I can come here and share with you all. So I discovered this new tool that would help us send emails directly from Google Sheet. And I tried using it and I tell you that the result so far has not been bad at all. So for starters, this can also be one of the best ways for you to start sending out book emails directly into the inbox folder of a recipient. So stay tuned and let's get into it. So firstly, to access Google Sheet, you want to come over to your browser. Then you want to click on this boss icon close to your Google profile picture. Right here, you will find all of Google software's applications here. But I want you to come down to this very part and um, you see this one that says Sheet. So here is the Google Sheet that we are looking for. So you want to go ahead and open this. So majorly, if you have your any of your documents stored up in a CXV format, basically you'll find them here on Google Sheet, right? And um, for your email list as well, if you have your email list stored up in a CXV file format, you will definitely have it right here. And that would make it easy for you to start sending out your book emails, all right? But for me, my emails were delivered in a TXT file. So I'll go ahead and just add them as a CXV file by clicking on blank sheet, um, I'll name this column email column, which is where I'll input all the emails I want to send book emails to. And based on me just showing you guys how to send book emails directly from Google Sheet, I've got a few email addresses here for example, right? So um, let me just copy all of these right now and I'm going to paste them into my Google Sheet and that's it. So you can see I already have my own emails in Google Sheet. And if you have that, then we are ready to go over to the next step. So secondly, we need to prepare our email message, okay? I want to come over to my Gmail account and basically I'm going to pretend like I want to send an email to someone. But right here where you have the recipient, I want you to leave this blank, okay? You don't have to add any email address. Remember, you're pretending like you want to send out um your email, right? So you want to come back to the subject line, okay? Come down to the subject line and um, type in what you want to put in here. So for me, I'm just going to write something random here. And I'll go ahead and input my email message. So that is what you need to do. All right. So please make sure to avoid imputing any email address at the recipient box. Okay. Add your subject text and your email message. Okay. Now I want you to go ahead and close this. Okay. Because when you do, you won't lose your email, but rather it will be saved up as a draft message. And this is what we are looking at. Okay. This is what we want. We want to make sure that our message is basically stored up as a draft message. Now, if I go over to my draft, okay, you can see that I have my message right here. So now I want you to follow me really, really closely. So basically, we are making smooth progress right here, okay? Now, I need you to come back to the Google Sheet. Now, I want you to come over to this place and I want you to click on extension, okay? Then you want to hover around add-ons, okay? Select get add-ons. Now, you are brought over to the Google Workspace Marketplace. So this is basically where you're going to be finding a whole lot of extension that can be used to assist you with your day-to-day -day business activities. Now, I want you to come over to this place and you want to search for Mego, okay? Spelled as M-E-R-G-O. So basically, that is actually how I pronounce it. So I, I, I don't know if that is the real pronunciation, but then Mego is what I want you to search for, okay? And now if you click on search, you're going to be finding the extension right here. You can see that this is the extension that we want to install into our Google Sheet. So this one right here, having the spelling on its picture is the Mego Book Email Sender extension that you want to install into your google sheet so basically mego is a free to use book email sender used by quite a number of people including me myself i was testing this out you know and trying to see if this would actually work fine and of course for starters it's not bad at all so this tool has basically helped us send book emails and results so far has been fair enough okay so to install this extension into your google sheet you just want to click on install right here you want to choose the email account you want to use in sending your book email so please note this okay? okay so the email address that you are going to be making use of is the same email address you are going to be making use of when you want to start sending your book emails you can basically change this and i think that's only the downside that this tool has the email address you use is the same email address you're going to be using for a lifetime so you can basically change the email address and that is why i recommend if you have a business email address i recommend you use that okay and i did a testing on this okay find out a business email address and also a random email address but i can tell you this for a fact that so the results so far are much more better when you use a business email address than 
when you're making use of a random email address to send bulk emails. And that is something that works super fine. If you're making use of a business email, it's super easy for you to send out bulk emails, um, you know, without any issue whatsoever. But when you're making use of random emails, right, you can actually expect a lot of things like bounces, things like your emails going to the spam folder and all of that. So I know majority of you all watching this video might not have a business email yet. And I'm actually trying to figure out one of the best days where I'm going to make a tutorial teaching you guys how now to get the best email for your business absolutely without paying a dime that is something i'm working on and as soon as i get that video live i want you to also watch that video right so make sure to subscribe and you want to turn the notification bell icon so once that video goes live you would also be notified by youtube that i release the video on that and you can watch and learn how to get your own business email address without paying a penny and you can see that we have successfully installed this extension into our google sheet now that is good now the next thing you want to do right now is you want to go over and you want to refresh this and you should actually see the mego icon displaying right here then you want to click on the icon you want to select mail match and place this is going to be a little bit technical from here so you see where it says select a gmail draft so mego already picked our draft email from our gmail i can remember right so all my email drafts are right here on the mego application i want you to know that those two don't have access to your major inbox emails so you don't have to be scared using this tool it can only see your draft emails so you want to come to the email column and you want to choose email because that is the column where we have our email list in then for your sender name you can basically edit this to your preference remember the email address you can change but the name you want people to see you can basically change that so i want you to do something else i want you to make sure you toggle on this button right here so as to enable tracking on your emails this would actually show you your email result so it works more like an email monitor showing you the send rate the open rate the reply the bounces and all of that so please make sure you turn that right on and you can see that i've got only 13 email addresses here okay and you can see that if you're making use of those two I made a free version of those two, right? You're going to be entitled to sending over 500 emails every day, okay, per day. You're going to be sending 500 emails per day according to the free version plan that you might want to be making use of. So if you want to go pro, you can basically go pro, all right? And um, you basically get a whole lot of emails being sent out with a pro version. But making use of the free version, you have 500 emails a day. And that is why I said for starters, it's not bad at all. 500 emails a day and in five days, you should be able to send over 2,500 emails. Mm, that's super cool too so now i'll go ahead and click on send 13 emails and you can see that our emails are going out already over three emails sent and still sending so if you talk about fast how super fast it too can be i told you mego is basically fast okay i just typed in send i just pressed send 13 emails and you can see that the result so far is just going so well all right so basically here on this page you can see that our emails are going out already so i want you to look at this place right here this is where you're going to be seeing all your email stats okay so how your emails have been sent how they are performing if they've been if they've been opened already you see everything right here if your emails are being bounced back you get to see all of those start right here okay so the up or the, um, the open rate the reply and everything will be found right here so everything is quite easy when you're making use of the right tool so once you're making it the right so you basically not stress yourself with sending book emails so the right tool is what you should always try for make sure to always use the right tool when it comes to sending your business and in business entirely Making it of the right tool would definitely help you. So, Mego also has a follow-up settings for you. Most times, um, this will actually help you, um, you know, enhance your result when sending out bulk emails. I've actually tried this out, sent out most of my campaigns for scheduled days, and I told you that the result actually skyrocketed, right? I sent some emails some few days back, they didn't land so well, and I tried resending them again, and of course, I got a better result. So, please always make sure to use this feature if you care to use it. So if you enjoyed watching this tool in action and you'd love to see more like this, don't forget to subscribe and also turn on the notification bell icon for more updates like this. And also, I have this other video right here where I teach how 50,000 emails addresses receive my clients' emails and you too can also learn a thing or two from this video on how to send book emails that would land in the inbox folder of your recipient. So make sure to watch this video as well and I'll see you there. Bye.